Hello and welcome back, Champions of Milk. So there's one weapon in particular I was super excited when I started seeing info about the DLC. Of course it's not the Sharp Claws, but the offhand for this unique twin weapon rapier is throwing daggers, which kind of look like a claw and are also wielded like a claw in some attacks. The rapier, the throw quills, also has a critical rating of 130, S deck scaling sharp for an AR of around 388, and it can deal some pretty brutal damage in criticals. So I thought that kind of sneaking that claw into that offhand, they won't know if I'm two-handing or not, unless they look really close and pay close attention, so I thought that'd be a good choice. And this weapon does have some combo opportunities, but not many. You can buff it, of course. However, there are some drawbacks, a lot of drawbacks to this weapon. I really wanted it to pair well with my Dex Int, but to be quite honest, it really doesn't. So the first thing I want to test after can I sharp infuse it and can I buff it is can I buff those throwing daggers too. It seems natural, right? But you can't. The throwing daggers do not benefit from buff damage at all. They do benefit from counter damage. You'll see that around 196 damage, I believe, at some points. The normal damage of all three daggers hitting is 147. But that damage is not thrust damage, so the Leo Ring doesn't benefit from it either. And since this has some combo potential, I thought maybe Pontiff's Right Eye and combo bonuses might work too. But I tested it with that, and you cannot build up or maintain the combo meter by using the daggers to land hits. So pretty limited in their synergy with this build, to be honest, and with spells in general. Though it will deal incredible, incredible critical damage when you buff it, because that 30% extra critical damage will be getting applied to your buff damage as well. And this weapon gets a lot of AR when you buff it. Uh, around 579 with just magic weapon, which is what crystal magic weapon gets on the Cellsword Twin Scimitars. And above 600 when you buff it with CMW. I forget exactly. However, I really found that this weapon has a ton of drawbacks on this Cell Sword Spell Sword build, and I will be talking about that and showing off a comparison of my first duels in the arena tomorrow. So I hope you enjoyed, and I hope you stay milky.